What's up, lovelies? Welcome back to another vlog. <laughs> Today is Sunday, we're doing Reset Sunday and we're heading out to get our nails done, toes done. I already got this bust down wig on. She looking scrumptious, okay? I am actually drinking on me some water on my new Stanley cup. Y'all, I am a Stanley girl now. Never would have thought. Seeing this color, had to have it. It is a limited edition with hearth in hand at Target. So, she's hydrated. Anyways, let's go ahead, run out, get our nails done, toes done, and I'll come back and pop back in once I am doing some. Did I introduce myself? I'm Tanya, if you're new here, welcome to my channel. If you're a returning subscriber, y'all know the tea, welcome back. <laughs> Anyways, let's go ahead and get on out of here and get our nails done. But before we leave, let me do a little o o TD, but I have on just this little sundress, I guess, maxi dress. Nothing special. Have my hat on. It's getting fall. Um, Target. This dress came from Charlotte Rue, and this came from Forever 21. A lot, like a long time ago. But anyways, I need to grab a purse. We need a purse. Mm. We need a purse, but something a little sporty i don't have too much in here it's probably in my other room so yeah i need to change bags and then we're gonna head out the door so guys i'm at the nail salon right now actually i'm about to sit back and look on pinterest to see what i'm exactly getting because i have no idea i don't know if i want to go short or long the last time i had them short and i didn't like how one of the guys did it but the time before that i had him short again and i really did like how he did them but i'm not sure if i want to uh, i'm not sure if i want to go long or not i know i want to i want something simple and plain i don't want anything i guess flashy i'm not really big on like designs like that i like my nails to be real simple one color uh and one like sh particular shape i prefer like a skinny ballerina if i'm gonna get them long if i'm gonna get them short baby it, i want them short short like, i'm gonna stick with just the white toes because it's a no-brainer for fall i want to have like a a signature look and i'm not sure if i want it to be long or short i feel like editing i can i can maneuver on the keyboard a little bit better with shorter nails but if i get long nails i don't want them to be like medium long i want them to be actual long nails but i don't know y'all i'm thinking i'm gonna go with a bubble bath and just a little just a little tip anyways um let me get out of here i brought my jean jacket just in case it's a little chilly in there and this is the bag that i ended up going with y'all know i am in love with this this is actually i think Kurt Geiger has a bag. He works with a lot of like textures like this when it comes to like his designs. So maybe that's what I'm liking. I'm just I'm just into it. But all right, y'all, let's go in here. I'm super hungry too. Yeah, I'm so sleepy, but I just finished getting my nails and toes done. Um, I don't like them. And I don't think I'm coming back. I've been going here for like four years, maybe a little bit more than that. And I don't like when I say something and somebody like they don't listen. Like, I, I understand, you know, you're used to doing a certain thing or whatever. But if I tell you I don't want my my nail square, what is this? I'm like, can you round that? I'm going to show you the picture, my inspo picture that I showed him. <sighs> and I said I wasn't going to get upset today or whatever. And honestly, I probably should have just... Look at this. I like... I'm so frustrated 
because this is not what I wanted. This look like boxes. Like these look like little cubes. They like pinky toes. And I wanted them to be more like rounded and he just would not listen. And I kept saying, you're making them square. They're still square. I don't want square round, round them. And now I look like I got pinky toes on my finger. I don't want to get frustrated. There's, it's just nails. It's just nail and I'm being particular. And I do have the audacity to do that. Well, not the audacity. What is it? What's the word I want to say? The prerogative. I have the prerogative to be a stickler on my nails if I want to. I'm paying for them. It's frustrating though. Um, and I know there's, they could not have been that big of a, what do you call it, language barrier because I want to go to Ulta to get some Fenty body butter because the stuff that I've been using lately, I just, I just be getting ashy after using it still. Yeah, we back to the Fenty body butter. I have the mini one. I have the mini one to travel with, but I need the big one. I need to wash some clothes for the week. I need to do some more prepping for the beginning of the week. We're going to go ahead and plan for this week's content. And tomorrow I'm going to start filming some videos. Good morning, lovelies. Welcome back to another day in the vlog. Today is Monday. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I know I left off. I said I was going to pull out all the fashions that I want to put together this week. However, that didn't happen, y'all. I was so dog tired. I think I was asleep by at least 8.30, 9 o'clock. Um, so mm -hmm, then there was that. So I didn't, I didn't do anything last night. I just went to bed. Today was supposed to be a content day. I haven't done that either. I tossed and turned. Even though I went to bed early last night, I tossed and turned. I think I woke up around 2 o'clock this morning. And I literally was like back and forth. This whole hot sweat situation has taken on a life of its own. And I don't know what to do with myself. Like I'm literally about to call my doctor and try to schedule to see what could be some alternatives for this hormonal imbalance because I'm losing my mind. Good morning, lovelies. Welcome to another day in the vlog. Today is Tuesday. I've been up for a minute. Um, I'm about to get ready to get dressed and we're gonna go out. I wanna go to the nail, sa the nail salon again because they finally open today because they close on Tuesdays on Mondays so they should be open today and I want to go get these toenails <laughs> kind of reshaped something like this I don't know if you can see it something like that I tried to do it myself it don't look as good as I would hope that it would look but I just want like those little come on thing like the little edges right here I want them off I want them to be rounded I don't want them to look like little miniature piggy toes. Um, not piggy toes, but you know, toenails. So yeah, I'm also about to apply a collagen um, under eye pad. I have a lot of puffiness this morning, if you can see. Yeah, I have a lot of puffiness on my, under my um, eyes. I also did a sew-in last night. I need to straighten my leave out. Just a little bit because I, I don't mind having um, not sleeked edges when I have like a, a leave out because my edges are natural and I don't want to put that much heat on it. So I don't mind them being a little frizzy at the, you know, I don't plan on putting no gel or anything like that. Maybe a little bit with the real baby hairs. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't want to have like gel all in my hair and too much product on my hair. Mind you, I do um, use grease on my leave out. I use regular grease on my leave out. I don't care what nobody says. Back in the day, that's what used to group people hair. And that's what I'm gonna continue to use. Like, mm -hmm. so 
I'm gonna use some of this on my leave out and maybe press it out just a little bit and then brush down like my edges. So don't come for me when y'all be seeing my hair because I know how y'all did. Uh, what's her name? The little Olympic, the uh, Simone Vial, how they used to do her when she first came out was talking about her edges and stuff. Don't be doing me like that. Don't do me like that. Anyways, um, let me go ahead and wash my face, brush my teeth, do all the things, get myself prepared, come back on when I'm dressed because this battery is about to die. <laughs> and yeah, so I'll come back on and let y'all know exactly what's going on next. So I just want to say good morning. So yeah. Y'all, I'm looking like a naked mole rat. <laughs> I'm rushing out the door. I have to go bring my son somewhere right quick. I'm a little upset that I have oil stain from my Fenty body butter on my shirt. And I know that's going to be there all day. So, it is what it is. But, yeah, I curled my hair. I put it up in this little claw clip because y'all know I be catching hot flashes. And I ain't got no time for this hair to be on my neck right now. So, the claw clip is basically the same could do it a little bit better uh, kind of matches the shirt that I have on but again this is what it's looking like down and not combed out at all I just put the curls in there and just mm, put it in a claw clip, claw clip like y'all saw and so outfit of the day let's try to see if I can do this without I'm gonna just go ahead and let y'all see my bedroom for right now but this is the Basically the outfit of the day. Just these shorts that I got from uh, Target. They're a little, they're too big. They're actually an extra large. I just needed a, I guess a regular large. I probably could have got away with a medium. Turn the light on. here y'all probably still can't see it y'all cook it but this is what it's looking like um shirt yoga licious bangle i got from dillard's and then i'm gonna put on this parlene and pistachio it's really sweet scent and then I'm putting on my Target slides. Y'all let me go because I am real late. <laughs>
Okay guys, I'm back at home. As you can see, just came back from all the stores, all the runs, y'all know. Didn't get anything out of Home Goods. I did end up going to the grocery store like I said I was gonna do. Um, I only really went there to go get uh, some creamer. I have this house coat on because my house is freezing. But um, we got my favorite creamer. This is the vanilla silk almond creamer. Love that to death. Uh, picked up some jelly. It was requested. Uh, also some Eggo waffles that were requested. <laughs> I don't know about y'all, but if you have a large family and or you have boys that you, you're feeding a lot of boys or just grown or teenagers, get the chicken breasts in a can and some pasta and some Alfredo sauce is a quick, quick meal. Okay, so I picked that up. Um, what else? I want to start eating my acai bowls in the morning again so because I have been skipping meals and I know that's not healthy but I'm just I've always been a person a one meal a day type of person so I just picked up um, some stuff to make some acai bowls with so I have my fruit I also picked up some bananas I like my bananas ripe I don't like green bananas that's nasty whoever eat that sound wrong with y'all I'm just playing no, I'm not. What's wrong with your palate? Like, they taste like wax when they're not ripe. Anyways, <laughs> pick that up. Y'all know yesterday I went and got some salads. Although I ate one last night, I went and went ahead and replaced this one because I just, I love having salads. You know, a salad a day keeps the doctor away. I know it's apple day, but it's a salad today so i try to get my vegetables in some kind of a way so i picked up some kombucha this is my favorite favorite kombucha this is the um the, pe the peach paradise i used to love the the uh, ginger gingerade mm -mm. is this one for me i can drink this every day i can't say all day because your stomach will be mm. but this is two this is two glasses for me so I ended up picking up two of them. I usually buy two like I do salads. I like to get things in, t in pairs and then go back to the store if I need to get anything more than that because I don't want any waste. And picked up some ground meat. I used to buy the, the rolls of ground meat. I feel like, I don't know, for some reason they smell and I don't like the smell of that. So I said I'm gonna stop buying the rolls and just go back to buying like the packs like this because I just don't like the smell. It just smells rancid and I don't know. It's just it's just a weird smell to me. Kroger Stevia, like their name brand Stevia to me tastes so much better than the brand. Um, I don't know if the, 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 there's a brand called Stevia. I don't, I can't remember, but I just know that this right here tastes way better than the H-E-B brand that I usually get, uh, all the other brands. This doesn't have that aftertaste to me. The Kroger brand of Stevia does not have that after funny taste like Araspatam and those artificial, artificial flavoring sugars. For some reason, that one don't have that little, that kick of bitterness to it, so. Pick that up. Um, I actually went to Kroger because H-E-B did not have Blue Runner New Orleans style red beans. So this is the New Orleans spicy red beans and my kids absolutely love these. So I went to a store out here named Fiesta. Um, they usually have all like this kind of stuff like Cajun food and um, Latin foods, um, Asian foods. Like they like a specialty type of store like international type brand store um they usually carry everything so yeah i got three of these just cut up some sausage in it and some onion bell pepper season it up and you have red beans and right well you gotta make the rice so some rice and then you have like a meal i plan on doing um probably like some fried pork chops or something tonight or maybe no i don't want to bake them it's gonna take too long so I'm probably gonna fry a couple of, a few pork chops, make these little three cans of beans, and that's gonna be a meal. I feel like I've been out all day and really haven't done anything, but 
um that's the day i'm gonna go ahead and wind down for tonight start cooking my food and i'm gonna catch y'all tomorrow um yeah we'll probably get our lashes done tomorrow because child it's been a minute that i have not had my lashes done and since i got my hair done nails done might as well go ahead and get these lashes fleeked on out okay all right y'all catch y'all tomorrow good morning good morning good morning welcome to another day in the vlog today is wednesday we're halfway through the week today sadly enough it's gonna be the last day of the vlog so i have a little bit of makeup on i didn't do anything with my eyes because i told y'all yesterday i want to go get my um lashes done today so i need to i'm gonna try to do like a walk-in and try to see if i can get that done today hopefully we'll be able to do that also what else do i want to do today i need to go to target because i need to air uh what i need to rear back up on my air wicks and so i like to get them from um target and then i need to get like another o cedar mop head uh so that i can mop my floors and stuff downstairs um i told y'all this weekend we're gonna be doing a reset and everything like that so be waiting for that so i just want to prepare all of that now in the this midweek um i'm still looking for some more pillows for my bed i might as well show y'all i at first i was like i don't want to show it until after i finish doing it but okay whatever um this is what i got so far these are the pillow combos i want to get another pillow like that put it in the middle um if i can find just another cute pillow I moved my mirror y'all knew it used to be here on this wall back here and I just moved it here I think it it's it goes better right here like picture wise um and I'm just loving how I put this here when I wake up when I wake up and I just see all of that I just feel like I'm somewhere in a fairy tale like some kind of whimsical um place let me see if i can show y'all exactly what it kind of looks like when you when i wake up <laughs> i don't know if y'all can see that but it just looks so whimsical to me oh today drained me y'all today drained me it is so hot outside it's so hot just got back from my little errands and stuff got all my cleaning supplies for our reset um i did go to tar target and home goods like i said i was gonna go and i did find ugh, i did find some pillows now the pillows that i have aren't exactly what i was going for but i feel like they're exactly what i needed if that makes sense <laughs> so this is the pillow that i already have on here actually you can tell that there's some gold detailing in it, right? They didn't have any more of the gold ones. They only had one with silver in it. But if you look at the gold, you really can't even tell too, too much of a difference. So they kind of complement each other in a weird way. So I decided to go ahead and stick to getting the silver because that's the only ones that they had i hated to break them up because they were in a set like not really a set they had two of them available and i hate when i have this is the reason why i can't find another pillow like this one because somebody took the other one and left one so i broke them up and so i have the silver i don't mind because my room my bedroom furniture is like basically a gray anyways um, so I'm not mad at it. Um, it's still giving mixed, mixed metals. Okay. So then I did see another one of my pillows like I already have, but it doesn't have, it doesn't have this little detail right here all the way around. Like these do like this has the little hemming all the way around and I could not for the life of me find another pillow like that in that color so they had one that was a little more taupey uh than the brown and i was like okay well that guess that could contrast not contrast but yeah 
it can match with this you know what I'm saying so I was like okay so it won't be all matchy matchy it will it will do so let me set this up and I'll go ahead and show y'all what I'm talking about okay let's see okay this is gonna go here it's still I'm still able to see the little hemming at the top because that pillow only has hemming on one side so I mean I guess that's cool but then we have this one here in the gray and we're gonna put this one over here I think this works out I think it works out and then and then one pillow maybe let's see I think that works out let me show y'all my bed is not made the best but I guess this, this is how it's looking. Um, I think that's fine. What do y'all think? I have the blanket, the duvet, and then that. This duvet matches my curtains over here, which is like a cream. Because I told y'all I wanted to go a little darker on the brown. But I think this is actually pretty, pretty good. They don't match. They're a little off. You know what I'm saying? They're, they, they give... They're giving what needs to be gave. And like I said, this taupe is not of a brown. I don't know if you can tell the difference. Which you, yeah, you can tell the difference. Um, yeah. So I think this is cute. I think I've, I did it. I did something here. Okay. Yeah, I like that. Y'all like that? Let me know in the comments. Um. If y'all can vibe with that. Ooh, what was that? Let me know if y'all can vibe with that. Um, like I said, I still need to get some lamps. I seen some at Target today. They were $90 a piece, but they have the exact shape. They have the, the vase at the bottom, and it has that nice uh, triangular uh, top to it. They're just not that big. I wanted something a little bit big. But I feel like it'll go so well with the taupe color that I have in um, these pillows, especially the middle one. They go so good. I might order them. I don't know. I I just spent a whole bunch of money on a whole bunch of pillows. Um, I think I may have about $200 worth of pillows up here, which is crazy. So I did end up going to Target. I told y'all I needed to get another bra. I haven't. Yeah, when I tell you I haven't really, like, really went in, got myself measured for the tatas and stuff. I've been having this bra that I have on right now. I hardly ever wear it. I really do hate underwired bras. Um, but they give so much structure, you know, better structure. I feel like when I wear something that without a, a wire, it kind of does this little weird thing up here. And it, it looks all bulky. Um, so when I was in Target, I went on over and checked out the bras. I didn't try them on. But yeah, I found this bra, this bra at uh, Target. It is the Warner's um, Simply Perfect Underarm Smoothing Bra. I don't know if I really have too much problems with Girl, yes I do, stop playing Tanya. So yeah, I got this. Um, I don't know if I'm not. And they had this blue robe. Y'all know I am Going through the change, child. I'm going through the change. I gotta be, cause child. Whoo! I'm I'm having a hot flash right now. Um, look at this. You can see I got sweat busting out on my forehead. Um. Oh, my lashes. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm yeah, I got dolly eyed, full. I believe full dolly eye, dolly eyes, starting from 15. So I mean, with the longest length of 15. So. Oh Jesus, child. Somebody opened the oven. <sighs> oh, Jesus. This ain't right. This ain't right for nobody. Oh, this ain't right. Hold, oops. Hold on, y'all. Who? hold on. Okay. Whew. And then I just got the pants. So I just got the pants and the robe because of this issue going on. Usually in the wintertime, I have my my big fluffy uh robe on my burgundy one that i absolutely love and burgundy is in color this season so the star of the show 
would have to be what's in this box. Hello. Hello. Do y'all see the little bow on the side? It has the nice kitten heels because auntie is in that age bracket. Well, we don't want to be doing the stilettos. Not all the time. But these look so good on my feet. But that's all I have for now. Um, this is probably going to be the end of today's vlog. I know I didn't bring y'all with me into the stores because baby... For one, it was a thousand degrees outside and my, my oven was turning on and off and it was getting, I was getting, eh. if you're going through this or something like this, it's so irritating. It's irritating. I get so flustered. Um, even driving today was just like, I was so like road rage, not really road rage, but in really road rage, like, you know, kind of like not saying the nicest things to people, even though they couldn't hear me. <laughs> But, y'all, this is, I feel it's torture. I didn't call my doctor. Y'all, my camera died. But I didn't call the doctor like I said I was. Uh, what I did was start back taking my estrogen. And I just, I'm just going to give it the 20. I, say they, I think they said give it two weeks to work in. So I'm going to try to just be consistent. Taking it on, you know, every day on the hour like I supposed to and I didn't ain't like a dummy and here I am back at square one but I'm gonna try to be consistent for the next two weeks and see if they improve and I know that they they have been improving they're coming a little bit further apart like maybe once um 45 minutes instead of every 25 minutes because it was to the point where it was they were coming every 25 minutes like <laughs> like contractions and so um I'm happy to see that they're like going you know they're they're not I can't see that they're not intense because they are but I've had some that was really 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 intense and then some of them are not as intense you, it, yeah some of them are not as that intense and some of them like the one that I just had was pretty intense but it didn't last that long anyways um yeah Y'all, I've just been getting going through it. But anyways, I don't want to I don't want to stay on negative too long. I've had an amazing week with y'all. So, if you made it all the way to the end of this video, I thank you for your continued support if you are already subscribed. If you're not subscribed, what are you waiting on? <laughs> you made it all the way to the video. <laughs> Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell and then yeah, go ahead and hit that like button if you enjoyed the video and even if you didn't like it anyway. Thank you for watching. Y'all stay blessed, be safe, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye, y'all.